and a car park traditional fluorescent lighting is about 42% of the whole energy consumption. The rest of energy is used for smoke extractors, equipment, and facility infrastructure. Reducing lighting energy consumption will lower our monthly electric bill. Any lighting reduction must be in accordance to the technical building code, which requires 50 lux at ground level. Advanced Wireless Dynamics, a technology M2M machine-to-machine -machine company, has packaged an innovative and efficient solution based on wireless sensors for LED lighting management and control. LEDs use energy more efficiently, consuming 2 watts per square meter per 100 lakhs instead of the 5.7 watts on fluorescent lighting. They provide a more uniform light, minimizing dim areas and increasing the user's perception of safety. The average life of LEDs reaches 60,000 hours, while conventional fluorescent bulbs average life reaches only 12,000 hours. They provide better compatibility with parking control systems since they turn on instantaneously. They are environmentally friendly, no mercury or lead is used in their manufacture, and they are encased in recycled aluminum. AWD's package solution contains a gateway to control the wireless network. This gateway coordinates the regulation of each light. It integrates many wireless presence sensors as well as parking space occupation sensors. It includes wireless nodes to regulate the intensity of every light. Each light has a wireless control node. In the absence of cars and pedestrians in the car park, all the lights of the car park will be regulated to a legal minimum lighting level. When sensors detect motion, the lighting in the area will rise in intensity. This rise can be configured according to the currently available natural light. After 90 seconds without motion, lights will return to their minimum legal intensity. The system has parking space occupation sensors. LODs of different colors will mark the parking space as free, occupied, or reserved. The smarter the configuration of the system, the bigger the savings in the electric bill. The basic configuration consists of two time periods, each one with two levels of lighting. The higher lighting level is used when cars or pedestrians are detected in the car park. The lower level is used when the car park is empty. As a common example, the car park can be set from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. with 75% as high level and 10% as low level. From 8 p.m. to 8 a.m., the high level is lowered to 25% and the low level remains at 10%. With a smart configuration of the system, the sum of the electric bill of the car park and the renting fee will be lower than its current electric bill, resulting in net savings. <music> <laughs>